Welcome to Open Source Options and another QGIS tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you the easiest way to clip a raster in QGIS. Now, if you watched the last video, we went over how to merge rasters together, and this is kind of the opposite. Instead of combining rasters, we want to take a part out of a raster uh, and make that its own separate file. Now, let's go ahead and I'll show you kind of an example of what I mean. So here I have this merged raster file. Um, if I turn this off, you can see that now I have just one part of that raster over here instead of the whole thing. There's going to be times where you want to clip out a certain area because if you're working analysis on an entire raster, it can take a lot of processing resources. But if you cut that down, it can be easier to deal with and it may also uh, represent your study area better. So let's go over how we can clip a raster. So for this example, I'm going to be use clip raster by extent, and I'm going to grab that from the raster toolbar. We're going to go to extraction. And we want to go clip raster by extent. Um, now with clip raster by mask layer, we can clip it to a polygon. We could cover that in a future tutorial, but if we do it by extent, it we can do it with any raster without loading any more data and we can still specify things pretty exactly. So let's click, click raster by extent. And this is going to give us a, um, a rectangular extent. And if I come over here, I can calculate the extent from a layer. I can use the map canvas extent or I can draw on the canvas. And let's just go through all of these actually. So if I want to calculate from a layer, I can click in one of these layers here. It gives me an extent um, and the associated CRS that goes with it. Um, I'm going to save this to a temporary file and let's click run. Okay, and there it's done. Let's close that out. Let's turn off the merged layer. And you can see that it clipped it to the same extent as that raster layer there. The both of, I turned that one on, same extent. Turn that one on, same extent. Okay. Let's try this again. Let's go into raster. Let's go back to extraction. Let's go clip by extent again. And now let's say I want to have a custom extent. Um, there's two ways to do this. First, we can use the map canvas extent. Let's go ahead and do that. So if I zoom in and I say, okay, this area right here is the area I want. I'm going to zoom right in on that. Now I can go in. I can go to raster extraction, clip by extent, come down here and select use map canvas extent and I'm going to go ahead and click run. I'm going to close that out and that one actually didn't work when we did it. Let's zoom out. We didn't get the data in there but you can see it did clip it to the extent. It just did not do a very good job of saving the data and I'm not sure why that is. But you can see that the extent matched where we clipped it to. Okay, that could be a problem with my raster layer. Now, let's go ahead and try to draw for this next one. So let's go into uh, raster and extraction, clip by extent, and let's come down and click draw on canvas. And I'm going to draw let me cancel that. Let me draw on the canvas again. I did, I'm supposed to drag and I just clicked once. Let's draw on canvas. So if I click and drag, you can see that uh, transparent square or rectangle covers the area. And I'm going to uh, get this area right here. And I'm going to go ahead and click run now. Let's go ahead. Oh, and I see what the problem is. I know why it didn't work last time. I didn't change the layer here. I got to change this back to merged. My apologies for the mistake there. And now let's click run. Close. And now you can see that we've clipped out that part of merge right there that we were that we had dragged over. Okay, so we can turn that off. Now I'm going to get rid of this one. I will redo this so I can show you what it looks like using the correct layer. And I apologize, I did not catch that earlier. And so let's go ahead and turn merged back on and let's zoom in to, we'll zoom into the upper right corner up here so that we can uh, know that it's different. And if we go over to raster and we go to extraction, clip by extent, and now we come down and we choose this by use the map canvas extent and we click run. 
Now we can close that. Oh, and I think I did the exact same thing I did last time, guys. Sorry, let's just try that one more time. Raster extraction by extent. Change this to merged. And now specify that we calculate from the map extent. And now click run. Close. And now you can see that we have that raster for that upper corner. Um, and we have our separate rasters. I'm going to go ahead and remove this one that I messed up twice in a row. And now you can see that we have our um, separate rasters here that we've done differently for each of those. So that's how you could easily and quickly or subset a raster and clip a raster in QGIS using extents. Now you notice that all these are rectangular. Um, and if you want to get something that's like the shape of a watershed or the shape of a polygon, you need to use the, the clip to a masked area, and we'll cover that in a future video. So thanks for watching, guys. I hope you've enjoyed this video. And as always, you can check out open source options. Hoping to have a tutorial up on this on the website with step-by-step -step instructions that you can follow along.